What is going on YouTube? It's the Greek man bringing you another Rust video. Today I'll be showing you how to combine a pixel bunker and a god bunker together. I've seen both these bunkers being used in meta base builds, but I found a way to combine them into one to create a deceptively strong core. I want to give a shout out to Gamelights who makes amazing Rust build videos and inspired this concept of adding these bunkers together. Let me know in the comments if you want to see a full base build tutorial using these methods. In the meantime, experiment with this with your favorite builds. Let's get into it. We're going to start with a pixel bunker TC. Build two square foundations to get even ground. When you're first learning how to set this up, I recommend putting a TC down so you can demolish when you mess up. It took me some practice to get the placements more consistent. Prepare to place a triangle foundation. But first open your F1 console and type in SENS to pull up your input sensitivity. Now remember what your number is and change it to 0.01. .01. Now crouch, look relatively straight and place the first triangle. Without standing up or moving your mouse, move sideways and ever so slightly raise this next foundation. Move it back into the first one we placed. If you can build a third triangle in the middle, then you most likely did it correctly. Attach a middle triangle foundation, change your sensitivity back. Now build a half wall on the raised triangle, two floor triangles, then a half wall on top first, and another one on the bottom. These two half walls should have a pixel gap. To test it, place a triangle roof and look to see if the gap is big enough. You could place a TC and test it before upgrading. If you can access the TC, seal it off, lock it, and you now have your pixel bunker TC. Now you could keep the race foundation and apply the same technique on higher floors to get hidden pixel bunker loot rooms. However, sometimes the race foundation causes building issues for the god bunker attachment. So for simplicity, we will remove the foundations and build them off from the lower one. You can also attach a temporary loot room to this TC if you wish. Upgrade the half walls to metal when you can. I would avoid high qualling them because you need to be very precise in how big the gap is to make high qual work. Otherwise, you won't be able to access your TC anymore. I also found the easiest way to access the TC is using a smart alarm. It's the perfect height. Just make sure you pick it up whenever you're not accessing the TC. Now let me show you how to attach the god bunker to what we have so far. Build two triangles off this side. Place a triangle frame and two walls like this. Upgrade them. Next, we're going to put a triangle foundation here and then a square foundation. Attach a triangle to the side of the square and build out nine triangles. Attach a square foundation to the last one and remove all the other twig, including this one. Build back with square foundations and place a triangle foundation at the end. But make sure the stone texture on the twig is in this corner. Upgrade it and repeat the process once more. Now standing a foundation's length away, place a wall and a triangle floor attached to it. Build yourself up and check the stability. It should be about 31%. Now attach another triangle to this one. The stability should be 11%, not enough to add another triangle. So stand on the offset foundation and place a twig single or double door frame. This will give just enough stability to place the third triangle over the gap. Make sure this one says 11%, otherwise the bunker will not open when the twig is broken. You now have a completed god bunker attached to our pixel bunker TC. Add door frames and doors inside the core. Just make sure the stability of these two triangles remains the same before upgrading anything. And I can't stress this enough, before upgrading the bunker seal, make sure it is the correct stability. Add honeycomb and build around the bunkers however you wish. Again, just be mindful not to change the stability of the two triangles. And there you have it. A pixel bunker and a god bunker in one compact core. There's so much you can do with this build, so try it out in a build server and see what you can come up with. If you have any questions, please join my community discord or ask in the comments. If you enjoyed the video, then please leave a like and subscribe for more content like this. I'm also probably live streaming Rust on Twitch right now. Come see how I use base designs like this during a wipe. The link is in the description. Until next time, Kalinichta from the Greek man.